The FBI is reportedly looking into the Manhattan District Attorney's Office over how they handle cases following revelations that some investigations have been closed after lawyers of high-profile suspects made donations. FBI agents have been gathering information about Cyrus Vance Jr.'s office for several months now, sources told the New York Daily News. They are investigating any possible undue influence in the handling of cases by the district attorney's office as they look into decisions made by Vance Jr. and his staff. Investigators have been looking at both current and former DA staffers and the extent of their relationships to outside private lawyers. The DA's office said they were not aware of the probe and the FBI would not comment on its inquiry. A lawyer for Weinstein, who was not representing the Hollywood producer in that investigation, was found to have donated $10,000 to Vance in the months after the DA's office decided not to pursue the case. In relation to Weinstein, Governor Andrew Cuomo in August directed the state attorney general's office to suspend its investigation into whether Vance mishandled the allegations. It was put on hold to avoid interfering with Vance's ongoing prosecution of Weinstein. In another instance, Vance's office also dropped charges against President Trump's two children, Ivanka and Don Jr. From a fraud investigation that was launched in 2010. The probe stemmed from a civil lawsuit in which some condominium buyers at the Trump Soho Hotel accused Ivanka and Don Jr. of lying about how many units had been sold. The investigation was still active in 2012 when Trump's personal lawyer Mark Hasowitz donated $25,000 to Vance's re election campaign. Four months after making the contribution, Kasowitz met with Vance to discuss the case. Three months later, Vance halted the investigation. Share this article Share Vance, a Democrat, said at the time that the fact that Kasowitz was a campaign supporter had no bearing on his decision. Records show that Vance returned the $25,000 donation from Kasowitz before their meeting, a step the prosecutor said was part of his policy of returning any money contributed by someone with a case before his office. Five months after the investigation ended, Kozowitz gave another $31,993 to Vance's campaign committee. He returned the second amount in October 2017 after facing scrutiny 